Hello! In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a free and paid course and how to attach it with your funnels. Now let's get started. In order to create a free or paid course, first go to your course funnel installation and log in. Here on the dashboard, it gives you records of all your activity for the past 30 days, from graphs and total numbers. Up here are the tools that you can use to create and add things that you need. You can easily create your course by simply clicking the Create Course button and you will see the courses that you have made and details like course name, category, ID, level, price, the date you've created it, and action tools to edit your course, edit the content, or delete. And right below is the button to create new course. Or you have another option. You can go to the sidebar, click on the Course tab, and a drop-down menu will appear. Select on Course Content, and again, you will see the courses that you have made, and below, the Create button. Now let's hit that button, and it will direct you to your course settings, wherein you can create, edit, and manage your course. And for the basic info, add in your title. Next is your course ID, and add in the description of this course. You can edit it right here. Change the size, fonts, and many more. You can even add links, images, and add media file however you want. Now select your category and level. You also have the option to allow downloading the certificate of completion. And you can further examine that on the Manage Certificates tab. And after that's done, save your changes. Now we move on to adding details for the price. You have the option to select paid or free. Free courses can be used to get leads so you can create an opt-in page, grab those leads, get them to subscribe to you, and deliver them right to the free course that you have set up. Or you can make it a paid course, have people pay you and then reach the course. It's totally up to you, but I'm here to show you both. So first, let me select a free one. Since it's free, you don't have to put the amount, discounts, or currency. You can choose to select extra courses or select sub-courses. And after that, save changes. Next is drip feeding. You can choose to use it if you want. Just turn it on and add in the interval days that you want. How this works is like, here for example, the student opened the course and they have access to the first section of lessons. If your drip feeding is turned on, the other sections are locked and will be available based on the days you have put as an interval. Next is Pages. Here is where you would attach with your funnels. Just copy the URLs here. Since this is free, we will not get the order page URL, but the registration page instead. URLs are found in the Edit Funnel page inside Settings. Take note that if your course is free, your funnel must also be free to attach the two together. So copy this code and paste it here. You also need to select your list, autoresponders, payment methods, and courses. And do the same for the other two. Copy and paste the URLs of, of membership page and course page. After that, now you add in your demo content. Here you can put your branding logo, just add in your media file, also for your course image if you have. And on here you can add in your promo video, just select the type that you want. For example, I'm going to add in a YouTube video just to show you, like this, and after that, save it. Next, choose your theme. And lastly, on your setting, you have what we call short codes, and we'll talk about it more later on. And you will see that course here on your Course Content tab. Now let me create another one very quickly, so I can show you creating the paid course. I'm just going to repeat the process we did before. Okay, now that that's said, we're here again on the price page. Now select paid. Enter the amount. You can use the side buttons or just type in the number. Do the same for your discount. 
and select the currency. We have a lot of options here, so you can select whatever you want. And again, you can choose if you want it to be an extra course or sub-course. Then select Save Changes. Do the same again with the other features. Now again, we'll attach it with our funnels. So here, I have a funnel titled as English Level 1. And earlier, we made a paid course titled as English Level 1 also. So click on Edit Course button. And in your price page, because I've created this as a paid course, take note that your funnel must also be a paid funnel. And do the same, click on the Edit Funnel button. And in order for us to attach the two together, we must copy and paste the URLs here. URLs are found in the Edit Funnel page inside Settings. These are the URLs to copy and paste to the Pages tab inside Course Settings. So go ahead and copy your order page URL. Paste it here on the Pages tab. Since this is a paid one, I copied and pasted the order form. But if these are free ones, you can copy and paste the registration page URL. You also need to select your list, payment methods, and course on each of these on your settings. Then save it. Now going back, let's finish up and do the same for the other two. Membership page. And course page URLs. Always remember the same settings. And once you've pasted all your URLs, click on Save Changes, and you're done. And that is it for today's video on how to create a free and paid courses and attaching it to your funnels. I hope you find this video helpful. As always, thanks for watching and see you on the next one.